Hello, all you beautiful people. It has been far too long, far too long. But I'm happy to say that I am finally back. These are the colors we're gonna be using today. But before we get into the colors, it has been about six months since I've been able to actually record anything without, you know, my emotions getting involved. So I'm very appreciative of you guys bearing with me through this process. I'm still getting the studio set up. You probably hear a whole bunch of echoing going on, so I apologize for that, but we're gonna do something super simple today. It's gonna be very easy. It's gonna be just a flip cup using the colors you see here. I have turquoise, aqua green, violet, a bright yellow, and this is like a metallic white. I don't know if the camera does this any justice, but it's a pretty fantastic color, so. All I'm gonna do is layer these colors in the cup after I get my base coat down. And then we will get started. So, how is everybody doing this beautiful day? It's been so long since I've been able to paint. It feels almost surreal that I am right now. I hope everybody's doing wonderful. I've missed you guys so much just reading your thoughtful comments and stuff like that was enough and it helped a lot so for all of those of you that tried to support me through this whole process i truly appreciate it so we'll start by layering the cup there is one drop of the coconut oil hair serum in each one of these so i'm just going to set these off to the side as i pour them a little bit of violet going in. This is also a carpeted studio, which I'm also not used to, so <sighs> I already anticipate I'm gonna have to pay to replace this carpet, but the longer I can stave off that cost, the better. Well, yeah, for those of you that don't know, over the last six months, I've been in an academy for customs and border protection. I finally graduated here about a week ago, and my new home is in Detroit, Michigan. So this is where I will be for the foreseeable future. but I'm very excited for this opportunity to kind of continue my federal service. And this gave me the opportunity to do that, which is, I, I'm just grateful for it, so. But yeah, this painting is gonna be something super simple. Anybody can do this. Um, all the colors you're seeing, they're all artist loft colors. Nothing. Nothing fancy. I'm basically just cutting my teeth on this again after so long. It's gonna take me a little bit, a little bit to get back into the swing of things for sure. So there's a ton of bubbles in there, which is okay. We're already seeing a little bit of cells going on, but <laughs> that's been a while since I've done that. All right. So I'm gonna let the colors kind of flow down the cup. I'm already seeing some pretty cool stuff going on. Let me get rid of that little bubble there. Man, I've missed this process. I've missed being able to bring you guys along on the process. All right, I think we're ready. You ready? I'm ready. That's crazy looking so far. All right, so I'm just gonna let it spread out, do what it does. Still working on getting my table completely level, but uh, for now, it'll, it'll work. Good enough for government work. So I had to get a new heat gun. So we're gonna see if we can make this silicone react a little bit. Pre-spin, I always like try to get the silicone to do some form of a reaction. And then that way after I spin it, 
you get those cells within cells, which I think are quite amazing. I'm gonna try to center that. I already like the colors, the, the delicate little gradient of the purple with the white there. And there's some bubbles. That maybe I can... Nope, can't get that one. Not yet. I'll get it though. All right. So now we're ready to spin it. Let me recenter it again. So I kind of see what I want in the middle. All right, here we go. Wow. Let me catch that. Look at that. That is freaking wicked looking. All right, let me hit this thing with the torch again. There's such a gorgeous little shimmer where that metallic is. Trying to get that silicone to kind of push through. Some of it's coming to the surface. I did not use much silicone at all, so... It's still very beautiful. very pretty just for a very simple effect that black background really gave it a stark contrast between the other colors I absolutely love it but I'm gonna bring you guys down we're gonna all check this out together see you in a second so as you can see that little metallic white added a really cool little shimmer and shine to it The cells are still developing in there. In this area right here, we got some really cool little cells within cells. I'm very happy with my first one after a long time. If you want to watch another video just like this, click the screen right now and I'll see you there.